Hello everyone. We are going to look at two artworks by the same artist, two very different artworks. Uh, and I'm going to talk about how it can be that the same artist can produce such dramatically different works. We're going to begin with a painting, and this is by Andrew Langusis. It's titled Bus Stop from 1994. And later we'll look at a sculpture that he made 16 years later. So he made this painting in 1994 uh, during a series in which he was very deeply inspired by the Renaissance era art of Italy. And of course, many artists have been inspired by, by that period of art and that place of art. That's kind of where um, art decided to start looking again at the natural world. Um, and, and brought in a greater sense of realism into the paintings and sculptures made at that time. And in particular, what fascinates Andy is that not only are these paintings beautiful, but when you go to Italy, the paintings, the sculptures, the architecture are still, of course, part of daily life. Um, and so it was this, this idea that what we experience today in the present is not necessarily a unique thing, it's actually a composition of bits from the past. And in a place like Italy that has, um, you know, if you go to Rome, which has millennia of history behind it, and you experience all of that in one day, um, just that idea of what time is, what the present is, is something that was really interesting to him. And he, in this painting, of course, plays a little has a little fun with it so he brings together three images of priests that would have been in a 15th century uh, fresco with a decidedly more modern uh, figure from um, something someone he saw in Italy in 1990 in the 1990s and you know makes a little fun because she's dressed scantily and uh, the priests either look very sad or like they're deep in prayer or that like they're aghast at what they're having to be near. But of course he shows us quite clearly that they're not from the same time because they're placed up on the wall as, in terms of uh, where they are in this painting. She, you can see she is standing on a floor and they are hovering, um, which is kind of an interesting thing. And he puts in a, in a different sense of time by putting them against this black blank wall. But you can see above that the wall is decaying. Uh, it has its own history in a sense. And we, we assume, well, maybe it's the same as what the priests have experienced, but it's likely it was a different history. Um, and that's, that's something that, that's a, a really interesting thing for him. And that's what's going to carry him uh, through to thinking about a different form of how time moves uh, when we get to look at a sculpture. 